Like I, I think I'm just the most excited to probably start a family because I would probably do that now, but Jason's more on the traditional side and says we have to get married first. Now that you're home and kind of hunkered down and planning, do you guys have an overall theme to the wedding? We just want to, okay, we, we've gone back and forth with a bunch of different themes, but we keep coming back to like, we just want it to be like Gatsby theme, like kind of over the top, like really black tie affair, champagne fountains, like very like, really not like us actually at all, but we'll have our own like unique touches throughout the whole wedding. But the vibe of it is going to be very over the top. That's so cool. Did you, have you said yes to the dress yet? No, I've looked, I'm only shopping online right now. I actually went to a couple little places in Nashville, but I'm trying to make it so uh, my mom, Jason's mom, and my sister and my best friend can all be in one area at the same time, which is a lot harder than you would think. Um, so I've done a lot of Pinterest shopping, a lot of um, like Instagram shopping, and then just went by myself to a couple of little spots in Nashville to get an idea. But I really want everyone to be together for the actual say yes to the dress moment. I love that. You, do you think you're gonna have multiple outfit changes though? Oh, yes, absolutely. And if you would have asked me that five years ago, I'd have been like, no, I don't care. I'll just have one. Like, why would I be so dramatic like that? And now I'm like, I want five. <laughs> <laughs> As you should. It's your day. Um, yeah. Last time we spoke to Jason, I think back in March, he said that the wedding date might be early 2023 now. Is that still the case? Have you We're set the date yet? We really want to actually do a New Year's Eve wedding. Um, so we still want to do it this year. And we're just trying to find the perfect venue. We actually found one and I'm not going to call them out, but they said they were available on the date we wanted and we were so excited. And then three days later, they called us saying, we cannot believe we made a mistake, but it's okay. actually not available that day. And we were so bummed out. Oh no. I know. <laughs> oh, it's so hard. Well, you guys have, a, I mean, you've been so busy and, you know, of course, COVID happened and then you were on the dance with right. the first tour. So I know that uh, planning has been kind of delayed a little bit. I know. I keep getting jealous seeing all, like everyone that gets engaged all of a sudden their wedding plannings and the, all this stuff. And I'm like, okay, finally, like I want to go on Instagram and do polls and have people help me and like look at my collection with Amazon Handmade too, because people can shop the collection and see well my first one and you can go to amazon dot caitlin wedding shop and it's just there's so many cool things in there so many i, I can't wait to see it it's gonna be so cool who is the bigger bridezilla you or jason i'm not i'm not one yet um i think maybe like when it comes closer to the date i might get a little more bridezilla e but we're both so different in in the best ways for planning because he obviously like you know has been in finance his whole life and he knows how to budget and like create a budget and he's really good at spreadsheets and all of that and i'm really good at like the creative side of it and what i picture and how i want it to be unique and true to us so it's it's a good combo i love that will the dogs be involved in the wedding Yes, we are. We're getting them um, custom made tuxedos. I love that. That is so <laughs> cute. That is so great. Are any members of Bachelor Nation in the wedding party? Have you figured out your wedding party yet? I, I think I have my wedding party nailed down. Um, I think, well, I, I haven't asked her yet, so I don't want to say it out loud yet until I personally ask her. But yeah, there, I think there's probably going to be one in there, but definitely some Bachelor Nation people involved in, in the whole wedding. Definitely. What are you most looking forward to about being a wife? <sighs> I don't think anything's going to change. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I already feel like that. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I I think I'm just the most excited to probably start a family because I would probably do that now, but Jason's more on the traditional side and says we have to get married first. So probably having a family. Are you going to enjoy newlywed life for a little bit or, do you, or, or is family planning fast track? I think it'll be fast track because we're enjoying the engagement process more than anything. It's been a way longer engagement than we thought. Like I remember we got engaged in May and we're like, okay, we'll do it in May of next year. And now we're in June and I'm like, holy crap, that happens so fast. Um, so I think we're enjoying the engagement and then we'll do a little fast track to the love fam. It. Love it. I love it. And I'm so excited because you have these storefronts that you're curating for Amazon wedding shop. So tell me all about it. Yes, I'm so excited because I'm going to be launching three collections of Amazon Handmade, which is going to be really exciting. Um, Amazon Handmade, it shines a light on small businesses and individuals as well as their craft, which I love. I think that's really important. And that's why I decided to launch three um, Amazon Handmade collections. And I'm getting so excited about wedding stuff because I'm finally home and mm -hmm. planning. And I love little handmade details and um, 
I'm just I'm just excited to launch the first of the three collections because there's going to be accessories, there's going to be apparel, there's going to be jewelry and little keepsakes and a bunch of um, stuff that makes your wedding just unique as the couple you are. I love that so much. And are any of these pieces going to be featured in your wedding as well? Oh, yes. I already have a few like so. Um, Jason and I, when we met, we always said that like the stars aligned and it was the universe bringing us together. And so when we first met, we got this um, picture of the stars aligning and where the stars were that night. And then we got one of them from Amazon Handmade. I got it for him for our anniversary, actually, of our um engagement and you can get that from the amazon collection there's one of my other favorites we got a wedding sign like a welcome to caitlin and jason beautiful wedding sign mm -hmm. um made by z create um i got a little i love you candle i'm if you looked at my office right now it's candles i'm candle obsessed um there's an i love you candle from sweet water decor there are a bunch of like unique unique handcrafted beautiful things i'm going to involve in the whole wedding i love that so much